If you do the things in this video, I can almost guarantee you that you'll be ahead of 96% of gym beginners and eventually end up leaving them in the dust as you transform your body. So what are the easy ways that you can get ahead of loads of beginner lifters? The common gym beginner, let's call him Callum, he joins the gym and then just wings it, jumps from machine to machine with little knowledge of what he's training and how much he's improving by thinking that just going to the gym and ticking that off is sufficient. Callum does this for months and slowly starts giving up on the gym as he hasn't made much progress. This is because he needed a clear strategy. What would you do if you're starting a business or managing a football team? You would have a plan of action so that you know exactly how you're gonna reach your desired outcome. It should be the same when you're starting the gym. Go in with a plan of what you're gonna train and when, what exercises you're gonna do, track the sets and the weight that you're doing so that you can aim high in next session and progress, plan how much protein you're gonna have, how many calories you're gonna consume, set some goals of PRs or a weight you want to reach by the end of the month, and so on. The earlier that you escape the winging it phase, the closer you are to seeing any physical gains. When I was in my first years of training, it took me a good couple of years to grasp the concept of how to build muscle and the key ways to gain the fastest progress. And the way I ended up doing this was by binging gym YouTube videos and learning the best ways that other people have been able to gain muscle. And hey, maybe that's how you found this video in the first place. So make sure you educate yourself on how best to train each muscle as early as possible too. This will save yourself so much wasted time and will make sure that you don't miss out on pounds of extra muscle that you could have gained. Another thing that is very important is turning this gym thing into a lifestyle. A body like this is created only when you take frequent and consistent steps. You need to focus on week to week instead of the goals you have in four years. Of course, have long-term goals in your head, but try and learn to enjoy training sessions for more than just the physical benefits that it could have. It's much more sustainable this way, and it will hurt you less when you don't see physical changes day to day. Dedication at this stage of your training will get you ahead of so many people, as you'll be making the most of your muscle growing prime. You don't realize how many people waste this first couple of years by slacking off, not training efficiently, using the wrong exercises, etc, etc. For example, with Callum again, he goes to the gym twice on one week, then once the next week because he wanted to go clubbing instead. And then the week after that, he gave up because he somehow wasn't seeing any results. It's because these types of people don't have the self-discipline to stick through things that don't immediately reward them. And often the best achievements in life need this self-discipline. There's nothing wrong with going out, by the way, and having a social life, but don't use that as an excuse as to why you couldn't find at least one hour of your day to train. Going to the gym or working out at home when you don't want to is really the first step that says to yourself, I'm going to achieve this no matter what. Now here's an extra point that might appeal to some of you more than others. If you are passionate about this fitness and gym thing and can see yourself following this path for a while, why not start a fitness account or channel and document your journey and your progress? I mean, this channel is something that I wish I would have started sooner when I was less in shape. Not only is it great that you can look back on old workouts and your old progress pictures, but it's also a great way to keep you accountable. Also today, the possibilities are endless. It could even end up being a job or a career for you. As soon as I created this channel and got underway with videos, not only did it educate me more on training, but it was also a really great thing for my self-confidence and allowed me to give back and help others get fitter. Maybe being a creator isn't for you, but even if you have a tiny liking to this idea, then why not give it a shot? Going to the gym and transforming your body doesn't always have to be hard work. In fact, you could actually use half of the effort that you are now and gain double the muscle growth. Watch this video right here to find out how. And if you enjoyed this video and it helped you, why not hit that subscribe button?